All right, uh, again, I thought we had a good practice tonight, uh, really kind of going back to the basics and, and really taking a, a close look and, and evaluating, uh, you know, our football team really from top to bottom. Uh, again, worked a lot on Auburn tonight, uh, started a little bit on Georgia, uh, but mainly uh, just kind of focusing back in on the basics and, and the things that we need to improve as a football team. With, with such a young team, how helpful is it to have like an off week after you give them a chance to kind of see what it's like and then you can kind of go back and work on some of those mistakes? Well, I think, it, you know, everything's about timing and this particular off week really comes at a great time. And with so many young guys, you know, playing as many weeks in a row as we have, um, you know, we needed it. Uh, it. It's really, you know, both mentally and physically, I feel like we needed it. And, and you know, it's good to come off a win and, and really, you know, look and, and see that, yes, we won the game, but we, we didn't really play, you know, uh, great in a lot of spots. And just being able to take our time and go back and revisit, you know, the last month of football, you know, the last, you know, four or five weeks and where we've come, you know, in, in that period of time and see the things that we really need to improve on. So I think it's, it's really glaring and it, and it really gives you an opportunity to take your time and look at it and then take your time to go out at practice Knowing that you don't have to work all day on an opponent, you know you can, you can take that time and work on yourself. So that that's really invaluable for us. Does this week, in the fact that you know you're getting into Georgia and then Alabama rivalry games, and your kids, you've got a lot of kids that have played together in high school, played against each other. Do weeks like that, do they get more excited? Do you notice that? No? Well, I think uh, you know, obviously this is the oldest rivalry in the South, so this is always a great game. It has been for years, and and. Um, you know, we have quite a few kids on our team from Georgia. So, uh, but yes, a lot of the guys know each other. Uh, a lot of guys have played on all-star teams together uh, or against each other. Uh, but, you know, it, um, you know, these kind of rivalries are always exciting for our players to play in. And I think they, you know, they, they really uh, embrace it. So, um, you know, we had a good preparation for it. Uh, and I think as the game gets closer, obviously, you know, the excitement will really uh, you know, the level of excitement will really increase. But, um, yes, I think they, they embrace these kind of games. Are you guys going to be very physical in practice this off week? Well, we're, we're, we're finding a balance in things that we need to do physicality-wise uh, and also trying to, you know, heal up some. And there is a fine line in there. So, uh, you know, again, we're doing, you know, enough physically, you know, with the pads on where we feel like we're getting some things done. But, again, uh, you know, we're trying to, make this you know so much of a, of a learning week and a teaching week and kind of going back to some of the you know fundamentals and basics that we were able to you know uh, really implement all the way back as far as two days go and uh, so uh, there'll be a balance in the two uh, we'll certainly do a little bit of both but um, uh, again you know the physicality of the game can't ever get away from us you said a couple weeks ago that Ladarius Owens would be out for a good long time. What's he looking like for the rest of the year? Uh, don't know. It'll be week by week. He won't play this week for sure, but um, you know, we'll keep our eye on it and see see where it goes from here. Gabe said that having you know that week of practice and you know, that was instrumental in how he played Saturday in his first start. Do you think having another two weeks will be even better for him? I don't think there's any question that. Uh, you know, for young guys that really get opportunities like, like he got Saturday uh, and being able to come back and, and really take a week and really, you know, try to refine your game and, you know, give you two more weeks to prepare, you know, for a huge game like this, I think it helps, you know, not only Gabe but all those young guys.